Hello and welcome to the latest Serial Oilseed Market update. In this video, I will give you a quick overview of what's been happening in Serial and Oilseed Markets. Throughout June, global grain markets continue to feel ongoing pressure as Northern Hemisphere crop conditions are ideal. High sunshine hours in, in the EU have been welcoming from the wet May experience in some parts of the continent this year. Soft wheat production ex is expected to increase in the EU year on year and Russia are forecast to produce a sizeable crop. The global grain markets are starting to feel pressure at the moment as Northern Hemisphere harvests commence. Welcomed rains in the US have also added to this pressure. This will help the development of the maize crop which is currently silking. Continued rains are needed, especially in Iowa, Minnesota and the Dakotas where there is recently planted maize and spring wheat. Furthermore, weather in July is a critical watch point for when the maize starts to flower. The improved weather prospects in the e US has benefited the soybeans, which has also pressured the oilseed complex. Further to that pressure, the US Supreme Court has made it easier for small oil refineries to win blending exemptions in biofuels, potentially reducing the demand for oilseeds. Recently, rapeseed markets have felt pressure from their highs experienced in April. Availability for rapeseed in the EU for next year has increased from improved crop prospects and the drop in vegetable oil prices over the last month has cut margins for crushers, reducing demand for the 2021-22 season. Canadian weather in the short term is driving the market as there are drought concerns as they experience dry hot weather in the prairies. To keep up to date, visit the Cyril Norseed webpage Subscribe to Daily Outputs, a link can be found in the description, or contact us at serials.mi at ahdb.org.uk.